Hi guys, it's me, Chisel Anderson again, and it's time. It's time for me to cover another Dr. Squatch soap in my in my product reviews series. Now, um, as you well know, June is my birthday month, so I'm going to be talking about. Rainforest Rapids for this year, for this month and year of 2024 because, um, <clears throat> well, the two bits, uh, didn't, didn't know that I could talk about it and I used, I used the part very, uh, very well. So, without further ado, I will talk about Rainforest Rapids. Now, you might be asking, so why, why on earth is he talking about a soap during his birthday month? You, know, you would think that he would have more important things to talk about, like movies, songs, or other other things. But um, this has a very special meaning to me. And this is actually purely by accident, too, this soap cheek. You know, after I get done making it out of a, a cube and a rectangle cube. But, um, this is, this is what's supposed to buy soap. This is a rainforest right bit soap. And, out of all the ones that I've tried so far, I'd say this one smells the best. It smells like, like, um, like um, a fresh meadow, N not coming out of scene, but but more regardless type. It's not like Elysium. Let me see. No, it tastes like wax, but it's got very light grit to it, and uh, it, it's called the um. The scent is crisp jungle rainfall for whatever reason. So we got, we got this in Walmart, but I only have to, because we all know that different Walmarts have different stocks of stuff. But um, the real reason why I just had to pick this one for, um, for this month is because it's green. And I love green because, well, when I was, uh, before I, I, I re when I originally began this whole stick of, um, the, the, my reviews and whatnot, my room was right underneath my dad's staircase, right over there, and my entire room was painted green, it's like rainforest. So, this soap reflects that love, where it lives, actually, because uh, the, 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 the purely back, I didn't do it on purpose at all, but, um, <clears throat> if you look carefully at it, it's the shape of a heart. I didn't do it on purpose, but that's what it is. Visit it again. So it's kind of kind of funny the way that like, the cheek came out like, like that. But uh, yeah, this part is pure, pure green. You know, it's not like the other uh, little mixture of red, white, whatever else. You know. And but this is a pure green bar with a little bit of grit on it. And, um, I can't figure out the one important thing that I got from the last video. The sub subpodification, basically that means the process of making soap. And, boy, I, w I would like to be in the factory when they meet this puppy because 
it just smells good. I'm gonna mess this up because it's the best one I've done so far. The next one in line is um summer citrus, and uh, that one doesn't smell so good. But uh, yeah, I'm, re I'm very proud of this the soap. And I can't, I can't wait to try it. No, but what I, I just regret that I didn't have this one when I when I was talking about the um doing think bed today because this would have been perfect. This would have been absolutely perfect for the time that we went to St. Patrick's Day. It'd be obviously green and all that. So yeah, I, I highly recommend this one to you guys because um, it's fun. It smells good, and it also washes the uh, entire body very well. So yeah, um, also the, the, the leg grit is good for people who are like me to have kind of sensitive skin that don't want to have like a, a, a million little pebbles on, on your body, like with heavy grit or medium grit, you know, it's, it's got true grit, but anyway, one other, one other thing that I like about these, these soaps is that they don't uh, break apart on your on contact with like chop objects or with your fingernails, for example. In that, you know, when when um, it's the, it's kind of um, a blessing in disguise for that, for that because you you don't know how annoying it is to have them. Um, large chunks of soaps underneath your fingernails and whatnot. So when you go out to parties or um, clubs or um, you know, the, the gym like I do, it's very, it's kind of disgusting to see a bunch of um, different colors underneath or around your fingernails. So whether it be like um, red or um, Yellow or whatever, it didn't make it look like you got an infection somewhere. But not, but not this soap. These soaps are nice because, you know, first of all, who's gonna assume that some green coming out of your skin is gonna be bad? It's gonna be like the, the incredible, you're gonna be like the incredible Hulk one day. Plus, I don't think that when you Wash yourself the dishes with the soap. I don't think it become your skin, your foam or whatever becomes green, like, like the other colors. Except maybe, except maybe the black one. But that, that's for a different day. I didn't try that one yet. Well, I tried one, well, but I, I didn't try them all. And I'm also looking here at the deep tea. Deep, the deep tea uh, <clears throat> flavor here. Uh, let me look at what it is now. The deep tea ghost milk. Okay, that doesn't make sense. That's wait, but yet at the same time, the you know the bar on the box is dark blue. So I, I'm ready to do that. Where they did that, take the rule and make it like a green color. At least with um, Rainforest Savage, it's green, therefore the bar so is green by itself. But um, besides that, I got no problem with this. That and the fact that Alpine Sage is um, it has a green bar on the box. But yet, the bar, the bar itself is uh, is almost pure white too. So there's another little thing. What was with them in not making the the actual um, bars, um, you know, white white color? 
Maybe, maybe they have something with cold that's hard to tell. But whatever. Also, it looks like this bar is $10 on the website. So, um, there are some bars that are $8. So, what, what, they, they, that means that there's a higher quality or a higher um, price to, to make it manufacture it. That's bullshit. Well, anyway, I'm getting ahead of myself. This, this bar is pretty good because, like, all the dental squash bars, they're all um, natural meat, they all got natural ingredients in them. They did the shit, though, but still, you know, who's really going to get bar soap? No, I'm not being, high, I'm not being, um, you know, I'm not leading up to anything. I'm just saying, who will eat this? Uh, I, I'm not going to eat it, the soap. But, uh, yeah, I highly recommend it. And thank you for watching my video on uh, Dr. Squatch's Rainforest Rabbit Soap. I love it. It made my heart all woman tender inside. And I get me to see the next one. So, um, <clears throat> this has been to my birthday month for 2024. And thank you for watching it again. Anyway, um, if you like what you see here, and you want to see more of my videos, you know what? <clears throat> like, comment, share, and, and to my videos, or you could subscribe to my channel. If you guys, if you guys, if you guys, um, want to when you have influence on my channel, you can always contact me or call me or text me at 631-707-3707. And if you want, you can get me on my Twitter account at Pro. Also, if you want, you can read, you can, uh, <coughs> get me at my email account at JJ's viewing channel at uh, gmail.com. So I love I love this this word spotification. You know the, the, this hand motion is really really important. It conveyed the whole um, hippie new wave movement that they were trying to go for. When, when you sit on the commercial, all natural ingredients and not paying me for anything, they are not sponsoring me for anything. Although I am, I am open to that. Because I like, I like the products. I only use the soaps a lot, but um, they, they've expanded. They've expanded more. Uh, Liquid soap, which I guess makes sense, as well as uh, holders for the soaps, caddy caddies, as well as um, a soap saver, and all that works. And they got uh, something that did the label toothpaste. I don't like the way this tastes. I can hardly imagine what it would be like to have a yeah, two-piece two version of, that, of this. Also, for the same matter, is that they have um, um, like a, a, an MS version of the two the sounds. I don't know how that works out, but yeah, they have it. They, they have everything nowadays. They even have a thing called COVID, and I want to try to find out what, what, how this works. So anyway, guys, um, I just want to call you guys and go out there and blend like the soaps. And, um, <clears throat> I would like to say a piece of my brothers and sisters. And, uh, <clears throat> 
<coughs> Aloha and have fun with, with all your little purchases. Mm, let me know if you guys buy any of the other insulated products through the Dutch's clutch line. So, I've only bought the tube soaps. I, I've been pretty happy, happy with these. As you can tell, I would give all my happy face of approval with, with some, um, with some more so than others. I'll put it that way. So, yeah. Let me know how you like these in the comments below. And other, I'll see you in the next video. Which I promise will be about a movie this time. See ya.